Hello YouTube. This is Marcos from Tortuga Customs. Um, I want to make a bench update here. Um, here's my update on my big rig group build. As you can see, I stretched the frame, lowered it a little bit, and just I've been sanding a lot. I mean, just the cap has a lot of molding lines. And uh, but it was good. It was good. Uh, I, I, I practice a lot on that. <laughs> As you can see, uh, there's a lot of potty around the, the whole build because I'm trying to smooth it out all that all the all the things that I added onto the to the frame. Actually, I lowered it in the back too. And. Uh, this has been great. This has been great. Very, very cool. I haven't done nothing more than that. As you can see, my engine is still the same. I haven't done anything to do yet. And now moving to the next build. Okay, I'm back. Um, here's a, a build that you guys uh, have helped me. Uh, I present this the last last year, and um, I've been working a lot on this. I mean, a lot. <laughs> I received a lot of help too on, on this kit. I mean, as you, as you guys know, I didn't have the the scoop, the wheels. Um, um, what else? I didn't have the shifter. Well, a lot of things on this kit, and. Um, I uh, I need, I have received a, a lot of help with the club and and John Paul helped me a lot. I mean, look at me run. Um, the captain sent me a, a hood scoop on that for this kit, but it was a one twenty fifth scale. I did I haven't contacted him yet to let him know that he's not a it's not the same scale. But I. I I, ho I hope it's gonna notice now, right? <laughs> um, to this kid, uh, the only thing that I have done so far that I is, is done is the wheels. It's, it's totally done, and I hinge the trunk. Looking good, and I hinge the hood. This one get me a lot of trouble the first time I did it because it's not a normal hinge that I normally do. I mean, it's it's the regular thing, but the where I, where I put in to grab the the, the body is where too far in the in the, in, in the front. So as you can see, if I close it, see, it's not the same thing. But it looks good when it's open. And to this kit, I bought a set of six pack. Really nice, very detailed. The carburetors are amazing. I get it from Fire Fireball Models. can see it's really really cool and really detailed. It's very small actually but it's 3D printed but it's awesome it's awesome. Let me show you the, the wheels very quick. So you can see oops they are that they are done. I mean they look really really nice. I sand it everything so they look like that. Very, very cool. Okay, moving to the next build. Okay, as you all know, this is my Rogue Runner. Um, I haven't done much either. I mean, um, starting to do the door jams. The hood is not hinged, the trunk is not hinged. Um, the wheels are painted. 
they are far from done but this much about the stance it's gonna have I'm gonna try to lower it a little bit more it's gonna be higher in the front just like this not much but it's gonna be like that I mean here I've been detailing all the the jams like it's supposed to be on the car um, so far this has, this has been great I mean a lot of sanding too right <laughs> and um, like I said it's not hinge I haven't done nothing here but the thing is right I have make a lot of progress in on the engine Not okay. 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 Um, the engine. I made. I put the pulleys. I mean, I've been uh, detailing the alternator. I haven't put put on the wires yet. It's had the holes, but it doesn't have the wire yet. I put this um, aluminum tube. Um, no tubing. It's a. It's a rod. And uh, I put it like a like like it's a filter. Looks good on both sides and haven't detailed anything yet on this kit just just this that's the only thing I have done to this one but I've been working um, slowly on the builds very very slowly and uh, I want to make a, a very quick presentation uh, one of my newest uh, builds hold on guys Okay, I'm back. Uh, as you can see, this is a GTO, right? 69 GTO. And this project, um, I'm, I'm really excited to start on it. I haven't started, I haven't done anything yet because I have a, a lot of things working right now. But um, this will be a replica of one of um, a friend that I have. He used to have a convertible version of this car. So, what is gonna be my, my biggest um, pro, pro, um, part on this project is chopping the, the, the roof and making it compatible. And um, his car it was exactly like this one. I mean, the same engine, same transmission, uh, same body, without a roof, and uh, and a few parts in the. I mean the shifter it was uh, it was different than the, this kit has and uh, the steering wheel too it's, it was a uh, back to the day it was a uh, aftermarket uh, original Pontiac parts but they were aftermarket and he had a different uh, tips on the SAS system but it was exactly like this he had it like over 25 years he had to sell it <coughs> um, and and we're working basically on uh, on his uh, mind, what what he remembers of it of his car. And so far, um, this is the colors that I've been using. I'm gonna try to get close enough to this kit to these colors. Is this is like a rusty red? I don't know how I'm gonna get it, but I, I will I will search on that. And the interior is gonna be like a dark green because he when he bought the car it was green in the outside and green in the inside in the interior but after that he painted on um, this color so the only picture he has is this one I mean I know it's not much but uh, the thing is that the only picture that he has because he was having too much fun driving the car instead of taking picture of the car but uh, this will be a nice and awesome project for me and uh, like I said everything that he told me is about uh, what he remembers about this car uh, the interior uh, steering wheel but the thing that he does to this car um, 
Well guys, uh, this is what I got. This is my bench update. I haven't made a beta in a while. And um, I want to thank you all, you guys, uh, for the support. Um, for being there when I need it. <laughs> and, uh, oh, oh, Charlie, I have this picture of uh, one of your pills. <laughs> it was in my park, and oh, no, it's not in my parking lot. It's, uh, it's my, my job's parking lot. And that was hilarious for me when I saw it. <laughs> this is very cool. Um, well, guys, um, see you next time. I hope you guys like it, what I have done so far. Um, most of the projects are ready for primer, but let's see how that goes, right? Okay, guys, so see you soon. Bye-bye.